Once upon a time, there lived a crane by the side of a tank full of fish. He ate the fish in the tank and lived a happy life. As years passed by, the crane grew old and weak, and he found it difficult to catch all the fish he wanted for his food. He was afraid that he would soon die of starvation. Then the crane thought of a plan. He stood sadly by the tank and did not try to catch even the fish that swam close by him. The fish, frogs and crabs in the tank noticed how unhappy he was. Why do you look so sad, uncle? Yes, why are you not catching fish as usual? I have got terrible news. The people are going to fill up the tank with mud and grow plants in it. And there would not be any fish for me to eat anymore. You are our friend and only you can save us. Can you please take us to the other tank? I am too old and will need to make many trips. I would also need rest between trips. The fish agreed with a sigh of relief. The crane started making the trips. He took a few fish first, and instead of taking them to the other tank, he took them to a rock. He ate them, leaving their bones on the rock. He rested until he felt hungry again and went back to the tank to take a few more fish. He then proceeded to eat them. He kept visiting the tank as often as he was hungry. Now, among the fish still left in the tank, there was a big crab. He too went to the crane for help. Uncle, uncle, save me also from death. Ah, I would like to try crab meat for a chain. Of course, my young friend, come. I shall take you to the big tank. As the crane spread his wings and flew with the crab, the crab looked down, but he could not see the bigger, deeper tank. He could not see water anywhere. Uncle, where is the big tank to which you are taking me? <laughs> I am going to eat you up, just like I have eaten up all the other fish. The frightened crab looked down and he could see heaps of fish bones on a rock. He dug his sharp claws into the crane's neck. He dug them so deep that soon the crane was dead. The crab went back to his own tank and told the other fish what had happened. Thank you! You have saved us from that evil crane! And from that day, they lived happily ever after.